Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Praetorian. And Jinx here. And welcome back to House Flipper on the PlayStation 4 Pro as we're checking out the recently released Garden DLC. Uh, so this has been out on PC for a while, uh, but Jinx has been waiting impatiently. <laughs> impatiently is key. Uh, for it to come to console for some time now, and it finally released today. Uh, I guess it'll be the day after. Uh, really, because it released on Thursday, uh, and it, I think it was what 19.99. Yes. So yeah, it's 19.99 on the PlayStation Store. Isn't that pretty close to the base game price? I can't remember how much the base game was, but yeah. Yeah, it's pretty close to the base game price, uh, and it's it adds gardens, guys, and gardening. You can do your yard finally, instead of being told you can't put things out there. <laughs> And you guys may recall, if you if you watched it, that we've done two uh, House Flipper series. We did one on the PC, and then we did one when the game came to the PlayStation 4. And they had done a patch for um, the garden before they actually had the DLC out. Mm -hmm. So I've been looking at these ugly weeds and this tall grass. Oh, without the and actual DLC? And not being able to do anything with it. Nice. So this is your house, right? The one you work out of? Yeah, this is my office. And so we're going to be buying a new house today, right? Yes. You, we're, we're playing on Jinx's save here. So you can see she's got $255,000. I got some monies. And you know what you want to buy? No. No idea. Know that we want to buy one of the garden ones, obviously. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Man, these houses are a mess, though. This one's called Boring House. <laughs> Let's go with the Boring House. That, the right, one house you're, in a thicket. Yeah, the one you're looking at is House in a Thicket. I'm yeah. good with whatever, wow. honestly. Look at that one. Garden after building the house. <laughs> yeah, we're going to go with the House in the Thicket. Okay. If you're looking for a house among trees, then this is ideal. Ideal offer for you. The house for sale in need of renovation is located on a secluded forest plot. Highly recommended. That is a miss. Should be fun. All right, so we're gonna buy this new house. Uh, but yeah, Jinx has, has continued to play this. She she really likes this game. I like to just put on some music and chill, or like if you're like playing a game or watching something, then I'll kind of half-ass watch you and uh -huh. play the game. Yeah, because it's a game that you don't have to like be like incredibly uh. Uh, attentive with no like i can you know stare off into space or fall asleep <laughs> you take do a nap. you do a lot of falling asleep as <laughs> you play house flipper and keep flipping houses so we had stated when we did our last series that last ps4 series which i think was like five videos or something like that and we had stated that we were going if if the garden dlc came out then we were definitely going to cover it oh good and so you know we had to be here guys for this because this is probably jinx's I don't know. This might be Jinx's favorite game ever. I mean, it might be. She plays it a lot, guys. I do. I don't know about favorite ever, but it's up there. Mm -hmm. And I'm really excited that they're going to make a Pets DLC. Yeah, they just announced that, guys, and Jinx is ecstatic about that. like they're going in a direction that I'm really happy about. Like, they're going to start adding more and more stuff. Mm -hmm. They're going to expand, like, the gameplay, I think, into other elements and take over... The Sims. <laughs> That's where I thought you were going with this. Bring that bitch <laughs> down. Like, good God. <laughs> I used to love that game. Jinx was a huge day. fan of The Sims. You used to play, like... I mean, you played the, the second one. The, you played the, the hell out of the second mm -hmm. one. But you played a lot of the, the third one, too. Yeah, I did. What are they, they're on, like, four right now, right? I think so. And that's I one have, yeah. you don't like. Yeah, you don't mess don't with that like one. I don't like that one. Well, because they... They went and launched it with, like... A small fraction of the stuff that the, the previous they game has. because they know they're going to get their money. Yeah, and then they sell you all the same DLCs over and over again. Oh, well, this place is trashy as hell. Yeah, it is. Wow. Mm-hmm, they got a big what old trash pile there. Place? What do you got, like... Oh, you got to shovel it. Pick up shovel. Okay. All right, so we're going to do some shoveling. So Jinx has kind of played around with the mechanics a little bit. I did, like, the initial, like, tutorial missions to, mm -hmm. like, learn how to do the things and get the tools. We took a little break to, to turn the sound down a little bit. It seemed kind of loud. And shoveling is Yeah, that's shoveling. It was loud. <laughs> Demolition jinx. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Got my shovel. Shoveling whatever this is. Rubble. Did we blow things up back here? I don't know. I think, uh... 
No, I'm not really sure. It kind of reminds me of that Sid kid from Toy Story's uh-huh. backyard where he tortured toys. Yeah, he tortured toys and shot, tried shooting them in his face and yeah, stuff. Yeah, with like, you know, firecrackers and shit. Yep, blowing, blowing them up or changing out their parts. Wonder if we're gonna find a body in here. Reminds me of a game <laughs> that I've been playing recently. One of the, and this is one reason why Jinx has been playing House Flipper, is because she can watch me play this other game, and that is Detroit Become Human. So, the game came out, I don't know, a couple years ago, and I finally am checking it out, guys. Uh, I've had it for a while, and been meaning to play it, and just haven't had the time. See, I've been, I've been playing that, and so Jinx has been playing House Flipper while she watches me play. Yeah, I was gonna play Detroit Become Human on my own, but I was like, yeah, I'll just watch you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I actually beat it twice already, guys. It's really not that long overall and i've been playing it for for weeks now but yeah it's really not that that long of a game and i actually beat it twice because i was so intrigued with the possibilities of all the different things you could do uh you know, but yeah with the multiple playthroughs mm-hmm. i might actually see the whole thing <laughs> <laughs> uh but yeah it reminds me of a part from that you know and you know there's a part in there where it's like there's a, a character no real spoilers here but he's kind of you know tearing up the the androids essentially mixing and matching and and uh just say kind of, there's a, a scene from there that reminds me a lot of that scene in Toy Story. Just monsters. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I don't know how long it's gonna take for the pet steel C to come to console guys. Forever. It'll never it, come. They might be quicker <laughs> about it now. They might be a little True. bit more I know a lot of developers are trying to like you know, when they have the, the multi platform uh, games and, and they, they they seem to be trying to release their DLCs at the same time. Where before it was always PC first, you know. Yeah. And so PC was, you know, if the game was originally a PC game, uh, we were even seeing that with Paradox. Mm-hmm. You know, Paradox has Stellaris on a uh, you know console and and PC, and they're finally getting the console version almost uh, caught up with the the PC version. Yes, yeah. I guess you don't have your shovel in your hand. Oh yeah, you gotta you gotta use that to build it. Yeah. To, I mean, imagine if this is the only thing you use it for. True. Your tool. Yeah, then why, like, have it in the tool? Yeah, that'd get kind of Radio crowded. menu. Yeah. Although, maybe I just wouldn't carry around my shovel. Maybe you gotta get in a fight. <laughs> shovel is a good weapon to have in a fight, Jinx. I suppose it is. Mm-hmm. Zombies and all. Or shit. Meddling neighbors. Yep. I thought you were gonna say meddling kids. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna beat kids up with a shovel? I would never say that. In a video. <laughs> <laughs> you know, she didn't say she would never do that. She said she'd never say I'd that. I'd never say that. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know when uh, it'll come to, to console, but I assume if it's not too far in the future, uh, you know, years or something, then I would assume we'd probably, we'd probably cover the DLC, uh, guys. Yeah. The Pets DLC. Because I'm going to get it. Mm-hmm. I'm going to play it. But, yeah, how long until they add people in their game? Um, I know that that's a big step. Yeah, maybe that's houses, House so. Flipper 2 or something. Maybe. It seems to kind of go beyond, though, what they're tr- trying to do with it. Like, I guess the pets is kind of beyond yeah. a little bit, it seems. You told me that, and I was like, what? Mm-hmm. Are you sure? Yeah, because it doesn't really seem like, you know, a fitting thing to add to a game that's about fixing up houses yeah. And selling them. Where like this this DLC Garden Flipper, I think, is a natural progression. It makes sense. I mean should have should have probably been in the, the base game, honestly. But Yeah. I can't blame them for being, you know, a little bit stingy wanting wanting that money. And it takes time and development. Yeah, and development, yeah. I mean it makes sense to, to sell it again. It's just uh it would be nice if it had been in the base game. And they the, don't give it out to anybody that makes mm-hmm. you pay for it. <laughs> Yeah, we don't we don't get these these games for free, guys. The, this developer's one that doesn't typically, I and mean, we've asked them a few times for content, and and they've never given us anything. Maybe it's just our channel. I don't know. True. They're like, no. Screw your channel. That's all right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we can do it without people. Well, it is it is a little bit easier also to get uh, DLCs on the PC than it is on on console. True. 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 So all we're gonna do is show. That's all we're shovel, gonna do. Shovel. shovel. I sold some shrubberies. <laughs> Are you gonna mow the lawn or anything? Oh man, can I hack this down? No. <laughs> so how do you get rid of it? You gotta remove it. Shit, I don't know. So it's like missing like holes. Walls, in yeah. yeah. It's got hole I can holes chop in down the walls. A tree. Chop the tree down. Just because I want to. Yeah. Not chop it down. I need to. Well, I mean, these two trees are grown 
next to each other. Yeah, and I mean, they're going to get all up in your plumbing. <laughs> <laughs> we got that issue now, guys. We got our tree that's like, right, the roots are all grown up into the pipes and mucking them all up. Our beautiful tree. Mm-hmm. It's a nice tree, yes, but I mean, it's a huge tree, but it's it's causing us some, some issues, guys. And it is incredibly expensive uh, because... In order to replace all the piping, I, we just we just can't afford it. It's like the main line, and it's thousands upon thousands upon thousands of dollars, and I'm not even exaggerating. No. It's a stupid amount of money. Timber. Because <laughs> <laughs> they got to, like, you know, they got to dig it all up and then and replace the entire pipe, and also they're plumbers, so they're ripping you off every chance they get. And so, yeah, it's been very unfortunate. This is how I mow the lawn. Really? Yeah, this takes time. You just got a weed whacker? I just got a weed whacker. They didn't give you a lawnmower? No, I'm thinking maybe. You're going to lock one later? That that's what that lock spot is, but I don't know. I feel like this is it. This is all you got. Oh, I do have an update. Or not update. An upgrade. Mm -hmm. Where you can make it faster. Yeah, I think I can do a larger area. So we can do that. That's the grass trimmer 2019. Increased trimmer range. It I feel 2021. like 2021. You're behind. <laughs> or you just bought an old I one. I bought an older one because mm-hmm. that's all that's I all could, you could afford. afford. There's moles to be exterminated? Oh, I was just playing earlier, but yeah, I guess so. All right. I was talking yeah. about whacking a mole. And mm-hmm. I said mole whipping or something <laughs> stupid like that. <laughs> and I was like, mole whipping? She's yeah. like, I meant wagon. Yeah, I get more efficient. She's trying to enslave her moles. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to put them to work. Get your moles out there working for you. Well, I mean, moles are, they're good for your yard. We could actually use the moles, actually. We need aeration in our yard, because, well, I guess we need a We yard. need a lot of things in yeah. our yard, Jinx. Like grass. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's, to be fair, it is winter time. True. Though we're going into spring. And this is what our, y- our yard looks like all the time. Yeah, it's mostly it's well, <laughs> Yeah, it's mostly weeds rather than grass, but yeah, it gets all jungly. We gotta go out there and hack at it because mm-hmm. we let it go too long between cuts. Yeah. So typically we like we double team it. Uh, Jinx takes the lawnmower, which is uh, it's a real tiny it's like a electric, electric lawnmower. So she uses that, and then I use the weed whacker. And so I'll use like the weed whacker to get it down to size, so our little lawnmower can actually <laughs> handle it. <laughs> yeah. Because we take again, we just wait too long to to cut it because we're busy. We busy are folks. Busy. We're mm-hmm. only gonna do our lawn like twice a year. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little bit more than that, but yeah, it's not. It's not often. It doesn't need it because it doesn't grow. We, we don't. Try. We don't really water it anymore either, though, because now we're just like every. Why water it if we don't even want to take care of it? It's just. It's just so much work having a nice yard. Well, we tried to plant seeds and the, and the damn birds, birds ate, ate it. them all. Yeah, the birds ate all of our seeds, guys. Like, why would you do that, birds? They're well, green. They just, they're just trying to. They eat. died. They're them. hungry. You're going to have green poop now to go mess up somebody's car. <laughs> somebody's car, yeah. Uh, yeah, we've, we've tried with the lawn, but we've pretty much given up on it. We've been in this house for years now. Uh, I mean, it's been, good God, it'll be four years this summer. Yeah. And so, like, you know, we tried. We tried with the lawn and to have a nice nice yard. And, and after, I just don't want to be in the front with the neighbors. Yeah, we also have some really bad neighbors up front, guys. Like, really bad. I don't want to be out there. Kids out there. Yeah, we don't even want to be around them because, well, yeah, they're just loud and and, and rude and just... They don't say nothing to us. I've never had them say anything to us before. It's just they're just just loud and and, and cursing. You can't be out there with the kids. And And the popo's always over there. Yeah, and then you got the cops always out there. Oh, and they're always fighting. Yeah, and then they fight out there all the damn time. So, I mean, we don't have troubles with the adults at all. The kids, on the other hand. Oh, ugh. God. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about, shovels. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the kids are monsters, man. And they have, like, a million of them. They're not even their kids. Yeah, they're like, we don't know what's going on over there. Cops are already in it, so it's not like we have any, you know, any reason to call. Because the cops are there. They know what's yeah. going on. Yeah. So it's not like we're ignoring the situation. <laughs> they know. They're well aware, and apparently, I don't know what they can or can't do with it, but yeah, it's just a mess over there, guys. There's so many weeds. But that's your excuse for not doing the front yard 
What's your excuse for not doing the backyard jinx? Money. <laughs> I don't have any money. You don't need money to mow the lawn. No, but I need money to make it look nice. And what's the point in mowing it if it ain't going to look nice? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> I hear excuses. But yeah, we keep it from looking too bad like this, guys. Like, once it, it starts getting anywhere close to this, we'll be like, all right, it's time to go out there and take care of the damn thing. But again, it, it is because, you know, we have such a crappy lawnmower. We well, lawn, gotta have both of us out the there. The part of the, the lawn that does Weed look nice whacking. is mostly clover which doesn't grow that tall. Mm -hmm. It grows yeah. thick but not really tall so you don't need to mow it as often. Yeah. I wish we could at least get that in the rest of the yard. But mm -hmm. so just dandelions. <laughs> yeah, we got a lot of dandelions out there. I just say that we're doing it for the environment. We're trying to save the bees. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's how, how we're doing it. Criticize everybody who's pulling their dandelions. Yeah. Neighbors all looking at us. You got this grass looking like my hair when you cut it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing it with a weed whacker, okay? <laughs> got patches everywhere. And like, is it growing back as I'm mowing it? Because that would be terrible. Jinx started cutting my hair. I oh, got just dirt all over here. Yeah. But yeah, during the COVID situation, you know, we didn't have any any uh, barber shops open. I need somebody to cut my hair, so Jinx has started cutting it. And because she, she doesn't know how to do fades, so I just have her just shave it all off. It grows back. I'm trying to practice fades on her son. Yeah, but. she's practicing the fades on her boy. But, uh, yeah, it can be kind of patchy sometimes, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be looking, the, I'll look in the mirror and be like, this is really how you think we should leave it, James? It was not patchy <laughs> last time. Okay, it last time fine. it wasn't patchy. But the time before that, it was like super patchy, guys. I had like a little spare hairs all over. And I was like, really? You want me walking around like this? Buy some turf. Oh, okay. So you can place the turf out here. That's it's cool. Really just grass doesn't even look all that great, but it's right. better than what we got. So are you gonna roll it over the the actual yeah. grass thing? He's like, I'm not cutting yeah. this cramp. Yeah. How's it work? Oh, okay. You just keep on. All right. Keep so yeah, on. you just roll over. So you didn't need to mow the lawn at all. We could just done I this from the beginning. I didn't. No. <laughs> Yeah, we could've just done this from the start. If you ain't cheating, you ain't trying. Excuse me, tree. Can yeah. you get around the trees? Or did you run out? Or can you not get through no, the tree? No, I couldn't go through the tree. Oh, You have damn. to cut it. You have to cut the tree down? No, you have to cut the... The turf? The turf. Oh, they have all that. Okay, I didn't know. I didn't know how elaborate this turf system was. Let's try to get it lined up. Mm-hmm. I think I put it right back where it was. <laughs> yeah, it kind of seems like it. It doesn't seem like it has much overlap, though. Of course, you are. Uh, it doesn't have a problem overlapping, is what I mean. Although, oh, it looks like you uh, went the yeah, wrong way. a little off. Mm-hmm. Oh, well. We'll get it. That's a bummer. We'll get there. They have tiny rolls. Oh, uh, do they? Yeah. An extra small. So, what else can you you do out here in the, the yard? I saw on the in the trailer that they had they had like uh, fountains. Yeah, I'm trying to remember to all that. We can buy. Yeah, I'm trying to remember all they had there. I mean, it seems like the outside area is about as elaborate as what the inside is. I mean, which I guess makes sense considering how expensive the uh, DLC is. Animals? What? What is that? Um, it's for like pet stuff. But you can't have pets yet. I know, but I guess you can prepare. All right, so these are all the things they're going to have in the pet. Well, it's interesting that, that they have all this. Yeah, like, why would you have a... I'm going to put one down and see what happens. You think a dog's <laughs> just going to pop up? Deal? Yeah. And we're just going to have the DLC? Mm-hmm. I mean, maybe they don't do anything. Maybe yeah. they just walk I'm pretty around. sure. It, I'm pretty sure there's not going to be a dog here, Jinx. Yeah, but why would they get my hopes up like this? They just have it in the game already, I guess. And you know, maybe it's just aesthetics, you know? Maybe just to make I it look don't nicer. want a dog living in this shitty house. <laughs> <laughs> There's Ow. no dog that comes with it, Jinx. You really thought there wasn't going to be a <laughs> dog, <down>. didn't you? <laughs> Nessie! Jinx got all excited. It's just the look Where's nice. Where's my dog? <laughs> Alright, well, fine. Are you going to sell again? Yeah. I got money, it's fine. Alright. Are you gonna sell this house? Yeah. 
I'm not keeping it. I don't like keeping a big house as the office. It just seems like too well, much. Well, I didn't know if you'd just be keeping like multiple houses around so you can tell people, I have two houses. I got two. I'm not greedy. I just need one little house. And get a little pond. Got a koi pond, yeah. Ooh, all kinds of fountains. Got a uh, stork. A stork, yeah. I'm worried. An Did elephant bring me figure? A baby? Yeah, you gotta be careful with them stories. <laughs> That's a cute elephant. And they've added a lot of stuff for the inside of the houses, too. In this DLC? Well, I don't know about this DLC. But oh, just, just over the patches? Yeah, just since, since the last we time played we played. Last. Hmm. Yeah, maybe we'll show some of the inside. Well, I mean, you have to fix the inside On before you sell it. Swings and can, you, can you use this stuff? That's what no, I want to know. No, you can't. <laughs> It's just then we really are going a pizza style. stove. What? Oh, that's kind of cool. An outdoor cinema. I feel like you gotta have a, a gym set up, like in your garage yeah. or something. These are just all the surfaces. We got a gym in our garage, guys. It's a tiny garage. Yeah, though. it's not. It's not a big space. We make it work though. Ah, uh, but the bench does. You know, we got a you know full bench, full Olympic bench for the you know be bench press, and then it also has. Uh, on the back side of it, it's got a uh, squat rack as well. And that takes up the majority of our space, guys. I mean, it, water the it's not like we sacrificed car space for this, though, because our car can't fit in the garage. Uh, the, the garage is in, in here in Colorado Springs, and this is pretty consistent through a, a big part of the city. Unless the, your house is new. Yeah, unless you have a newer house. The garages are tiny, which I don't understand because cars have actually, for the most part, gotten smaller. You know, obviously, you have SUVs and stuff, which... Are, are huge but as far as like cars go if you like compare them to like when this house was built cars were massive back then yeah and Giant so chunks of metal yeah they were huge vehicles and so i don't know what they were thinking clearly it was not designed to be an actual garage for your car it was a workshop it's just weird because it has like a garage door and everything like you're supposed <laughs> to be able to pull your car in but you can't. No car is getting in there. Most Maybe, people just turn it into another room. Yeah, turn it into something. You know, we, we turned it into a garage, but... Uh, or, excuse me, <laughs> we turned it into a gym. Uh, yeah, I don't I don't know what they're thinking. Like, everybody got Mini Coopers or something. <laughs> but that's pretty much the only thing you probably fit in there with. Yeah. It's a, Again, it's that, tiny. That would be tight, mm -hmm. I think, it, even with the Mini Cooper. Yeah, I, I just don't know why I like, put the garage door in there. I guess just for the look of it. Like, ooh, I have a garage. Mm-hmm. Even though you can't use it as a garage. Do you get money for the junk you sell? No, oh, you don't. I was gonna say. Not for most of it. That upgrade to the shovel really helped. It's going a lot faster? Yeah. See, like, what am I supposed to do with that? Just roll over it with Yeah, I feel like you're gonna have to, to roll over the gap. So you, you, you basically just made a little patch here. <laughs> That's all you yeah. did. Are well, you gonna I put had the giant things of rubble here that I mm -hmm. needed to shovel up? Are you gonna put this turf on the entire lawn? Yeah, and then kind of plan around it. Mm -hmm. See what I want to do. Uh oh, where's the turf? <laughs> Jinx is lost in the menus, there guys. It Got it. Tried to escape. I wish turf was so cheap. Although yeah, eleven dollars really and twenty-two cents for that much for a roll. Yeah, this is that's nowhere near the real price, and I don't even know what the real price is. I could just tell you right. I looked into it. It's a lot. Cause I was like, oh, maybe we can just you know roll it get out. Some fake grass, but you have to water the shit out of it. Oh really? Yeah, for it to establish itself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for it to like you know grow the roots down in the mm -hmm. dirt. I mean, that would be the best way for us to do it, cause we tried growing it, <laughs> just didn't work, man. I'm throw out a couple of those because I'm going to need them. Yeah, you're going to need 10. But yeah, I guess you got to try and like have as little overlap as possible while also not being crooked, which I think it's crooked right now. Yeah, it is, but it's fine. Yeah, we you're losing overlap. like more and more grass as you go, unfortunately. It'll be fine. I mean, it looks nice. I can it see how this will nice. end up looking. Although, one interesting aspect is that it's essentially, like, just going to look the way the game looked before your garden DLC. <laughs> 
Right. You do all this work just to get get it looking the way it already looked. Isn't that how it looked before? Like it was just grass and yeah, didn't need to be cut or anything? Yeah, I guess if you buy like a regular house uh -huh. from not the garden DLC, then it might have, you know, a decent lawn to work with. And yeah, you don't have to clean it up and stuff. Yeah, this is kind of a pain laying down the turf. Yeah, because it, it doesn't go very far. Can I just sprinkle some seeds and then magically grow? Does it do that or do you have to put the turf down? I think you have to put the turf down. And you can try looking at plants and seeing... Decorative grass. No. Oh, there's a lot of different choices, huh? Edible plants? Yeah, tomatoes and pumpkins carrots? and carrots. Okay, well, that's kind of cool. I mean... a garden? Yeah, you can have a garden. Though. Like an edible garden? You can't eat anything. Oh, they have a lot of, of flowers. Yeah, they really want you to be able to make that beautiful garden That's of your dreams. Cool. I'm gonna. Thank you, house flipper. Because <laughs> I can't do it in real life. No, it's too expensive and too time consuming. It, it is funny, though. We've talked about this in several series before, probably the last house flipper one. How so many, you know, us in the in the West and, and, and in any place really where they really do a lot of gaming... How we spend so much of our time doing this this work <laughs> on digital work, yeah. you know, rather than doing it in real real life. We come home from work and to do digital work. To do digital work. Yeah. Now you would never be like, oh, you know, it's I just worked, you know, ten hours and I can't wait to to go, you know, do <laughs> lawn work. To mow delete. my digital lawn. Yeah, you may even like doing lawn work, but you don't want to do it after working ten hours, I'm most going likely. To this house and see what kind of murder happened in here. I mean, like, it's it's really not place? that bad, considering other than the fact that, like, how did they have holes oh, okay. in the wall? Yeah, have your it's hands. disposing it. I see. Are those the only holes? Huh. It seems like they tried to turn it into a garage. That's what Maybe. I feel like. So you gonna take out the middle there, just because? No, I'm looking for my wall builder. Mm. Maybe that's what I don't have unlocked. What? There's like an outside wall builder? I don't know. I doubt it. But I was trying to see if I could build. You know, because you have to build the walls to repair there. Uh -huh. Yeah. I was wondering if you could build out at all. Couldn't but... you already build walls, though? Yeah, I could. That's strange. Do you have to be inside to, to get access to Oh, maybe. Building? Yep. Okay. Sure do you. See, we got it figured out, guys. So, yeah, we'll build it from the inside. Although, it's red. It's blocked. You gotta clean all that Oh, I bet I need to get up. a hose out. Well, oh, is that what the holes, hoses were? I think you got to do it from the outside. I think you have like different menus based oh, on whether you're okay. outside or inside. So yeah, maybe you can hose into it. Okay, yep. yeah. There you go. Can I just spray it all? I don't think that's going to clean trash up. It just blows no. it around. <laughs> <laughs> blows it plenty. That should be, you should be able to use that to clean the outside though. Yeah. Can you clean the windows with it? Probably not. <laughs> you should be able to. <laughs> No. You can't clean them from the outside, though. Mm -hmm. Before you couldn't do that. Oh, you couldn't do this before? Mm -mm. Not from the outside. Oh, They'd tell you to go around to the other side. Yeah, because everything had to be done in the house. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to make this place look nice, guys. Maybe. I do need a bed so I can go to sleep and make it daytime. What a weird freaking house. Whoa. Yeah. What the hell is going on there? I don't know. Those bugs. Where are we going? Yep. Oh, you got yeah. a bug problem, Jinx. Yeah, dim's bugs. Yeah, you can't leave I'm those. I'm just gonna vacuum them. And then <laughs> send them somewhere else. <laughs> oh, we don't even yeah, have, have electricity. Lights, I mean, you got holes in your walls. Oh, so. we don't have a light fixture, that's why. Is, it, is electricity just automatic? Yeah. I'm glad you don't have to do any of that. I can't remember. Do you do, like, wiring or anything in this game? You do a little bit for some things. Like the, like the, the switches fixtures. and stuff? Yeah. Yeah, I couldn't, I couldn't recall. Yeah, it is super dark, isn't yeah. it? How do I go back to my house from here? I can't find the door. You can't just buy a, a bed and sleep in here? Oh, no. I was trying to find the gate. 
Can you not, uh... I mean, I guess I could. Oh. Did what? that make it daytime? Just clicking on that? Or is that the light? I, I don't even know. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, there's no west or north or east or anything for us to kind of know which direction. We'll see about buying a bed. Let's place it somewhere. Oh, this, uh... This garage is pretty messed up. <laughs> we'll live in the garage. I was saying they were trying to build a garage, but they already have a garage. Maybe they needed a second one. Yeah, I just don't know how you, you lose walls on the outside. And and would you buy a house that's missing walls? Oh, maybe I can tear down those other walls and make like a patio <laughs> or something. Uh -huh. Or some unfinished project. Yeah, I'm just getting like a little cheap... Cheap bed. I want this heart bed, though. Yeah, I get that one. <laughs> I mean, it's not cheap, but... You Put swimming in the money? <laughs> <laughs> well, I gotta clean up the junk. Yep. You Nobody's gonna want to come stay in my heart bed with me. <laughs> well, I guess nobody really cares. You got hoes in all kinds of neighborhoods. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think they're gonna be too biggie. <laughs> Just means you can't charge as much. Yeah, because you gotta have that ambience yeah, to charge extra wash money. Wash the blood. Mm -hmm. Although I don't know, some people be into that. <laughs> some people might be into this. Yeah. Here we go. It sucks. I got a spray from all the way over here. I mean, you bad. It, seem, it seems like none of this is doing anything. Things. Like, even that yeah. muck over there is not getting clean. You might have to use your little cleaner thingy. Yeah. Gonna whip out my Swiffer. Mm-hmm. Oh, is that, like, the really good Swiffer? Mm-hmm. I'm trying to Swiffer the bug. Shoo, shoo. Go live somewhere else, please. Is that the best vacuum? Doesn't seem to be very it's good. It's the only Is there only vacuum. one? Is there only one vacuum? The bug vacuum 25. It's specifically a bug vacuum? Yeah. Like that's all it does? That's all it does. It just seems like, I don't know if that's the most effective way to deal with bugs, but. Yeah, well, that's what I got. I need to call an exterminator. That's why you can never get rid of them completely, because you're just trying to vacuum them up. You leave a lot My behind. And freaking out on me. They're all like throwing their babies off I'm their like, backs are you and in stuff. The room or not? Laying eggs real quick. <laughs> Yeah, it does seem go, to be like, super go, confused. Go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you gotta get out of there before, before the vacuum gets you. Alright, it's so replacing the infatuation bed. I'm get a pink bed. Yeah, get the pink one. See, I can't sleep. Can you not? No. Oh. I can only sleep at my house. Oh, okay. You didn't know that? No, I didn't know that. You've never tried before? I you always, go, always home go home to sleep. That's why, because it's your only option. Because <laughs> I have to. Oh, they're all mad. You got rid of the bed. Mm-hmm. Like you wanted to stay in the garage anyway. You got all these other extra offices and or extra rooms, and you're, you're gonna live in the garage. Where it's cold. Expose the elements. Now a garage can be really, really nice. I, I lived in a garage for a time when I was a kid. Uh, I say kid, I was a teenager. <laughs> I lived in a garage for a while. As a teenager, living in the garage would be so cool. I was cool with it. Yeah, I was fine with it. I lived in a garage for like. Five and a half, six months, something like that. Was it? Did they use it as a garage? Yeah, they also used it. It was a big <laughs> one, though. It was like a, I want to say like a two car garage, but a little bit bigger than that. Honestly, you couldn't fit three cars, but yeah, it was it was a big big old garage. So they still were able to park one of their cars in there, I and they still did computer. open it and close it while I was in there sleeping and stuff. <laughs> yeah, I lived in the garage for a while, it's and like it was actually pretty nice. Yeah, I enjoyed my time in there, I suppose. Other than the only problem I had was the, the driving in and out while I'm, while I'm in there. Obviously, nobody wants to, to be woken up to headlights in their, <laughs> in their eyes. A lot no, of motor going. Rough. Uh huh. But other than that, that was my only issue with it. Uh, but luckily, they had the two vehicles, so they weren't always, always using that one. But yeah, I was fine in the garage. I wasn't too picky. It was better than where I was, where I was living, so. Can't complain. Now, your garage, on the other hand, you got to clean that damn thing up for I'm sleeping there, Jinx. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess you got the blood picked up and the bugs. Yeah, but... I at least got the blood cleaned up. Mm -hmm. 
I feel like we're gonna put a gravel border around here so that I don't have to do all that grass. <laughs> a gravel border? Yeah, like a little, mm -hmm. or do we have mulch? Is there mulch? And Jinx has not really gotten to play with the DLC much, so you're kind of seeing her explore things, you know, for the first time. You got bark, wood shavings. I need. Get all over the damn place. I like that deep red. Mm hmm I think you, oh, you can get tiny. <laughs> yeah, that is a little tiny. What well, would you do with that tiny? <laughs> so how are you planning on placing this? I was gonna do it around the bushes. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, I see what you mean. Like around the trees and yeah. stuff? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, I guess won't. that. Yeah, I guess that'd make it a lot easier to deal with that. Couldn't you like place your grass and stuff first though? And yeah, then... that's what I was gonna do, but then I was getting lazy. Uh -huh. Like that's a lot of grass. Yeah, it's gonna take a while to get this. I think what we might All end up grass, doing. Yeah. Yeah, what we might end up doing is have Jinx do some of this off camera, just cause it's grass placing. Yeah, cause I was just gonna do missions in the beginning, but. Jordan's like, buy a house. <laughs> Renovate a whole yard. I want to uh, spend all Jinx's money. <laughs> he does. He's got 200 something grand, man. Well, I did. I don't anymore. Mm -hmm. well, I mean, you could sell this house. I bet you make a True. fortune on it. I bet I could. Mm -hmm. They're just buying the yard, Tiny though. Fortune. It's going to be one of those houses where you don't even like the house. You're just buying the yard. Yeah. You know, and I'm so glad we didn't do that, guys. Because mm -hmm. we had considered when we were first looking for a house and stuff, there were a couple of houses we really didn't like the house, and so we we're gonna, but we really liked the yards. So we we're gonna buy it just for the yard, and I'm glad we didn't, since it turns out we're not really yard people. I don't know. That one yard was pretty cool. Yeah, like, that one was not a choice though. Had like an in ground trampoline. Yeah, that was kind of cool, and it, it was big. That was the thing. Yeah. It was a massive yard. It was. Way bigger than we expected to had ever like get. Had like a CrossFit training grounds out there. It was it was a cool yard. So that one that wasn't really a choice though. It's that we yeah. we got a, uh, somebody offered a much higher amount than than we could afford. Like damn you. Mm -hmm. Cutthroats. The uh, home buy mark around here is like that though, man. We're again gonna try looking for a house this year, guys. We'll see how well that goes, uh, but. My hopes are low. <laughs> yeah. we. You, some of you guys may recall, we tried uh, buying a house last year, and unfortunately, we could not get approved for anywhere near enough. Like, we couldn't even get approved for enough to to buy our house. But to buy our own house. To buy our own yeah. house that we are currently in and what we were setting <laughs> that for sale at. Uh, so we couldn't even buy our own damn house. And we're trying to upgrade, so that kind of shows you where you're at yeah that was my thing i don't want to pay more money to have a crappier house same or the same house, house or shittier yeah and it's not a nice house guys we live in a <laughs> little tiny tiny house it's like oh well if you you know you want to trade out your mansion <laughs> <laughs> so yeah it's it's not something to be optimistic about unfortunately but we're, we're gonna try we'll go looking uh, we we're, we have a better uh, money situation than we did before because the thing that gets you is actually the YouTube uh, because it's you know it's considered you know self employment and so they have all kinds of rules with it like uh, what they consider for for your loan like for instance you got to have been doing it for two years rather than a regular job we're just got to have that for a year so you got to have your your income from your uh, you know from your job from your self employment for two years before they'll count it. And so when we bought this house, they didn't even count our YouTube income because we hadn't been earning YouTube income for two years yet at that point. Of course, now we've been doing this for, I don't know, five, six years, whatever. Oh, I think it'll be... Yeah, it's time. Yeah, it'll be this September. We started it in 2015 in September. So yeah, this September will be six years on YouTube. Good. Green for you, serious? Yep. <laughs> yeah, we've been doing this for six years. It's a long time that time just flies. Oh. It shows you how quick time is going for and us, at least. slow. <laughs> Growth. <laughs> yeah, I guess the channels. I mean, considering the fact that we've been doing it for this long and maybe we're closing in on 62,000 subs. So, yeah, growth is growth is slow. Some channels grow much faster than us, obviously. But, uh, yeah, our channel is actually, I think, average growth or whatever. Like, That's where it's we're at. so patchy. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, you got a lot of work to do on this this damn lawn, Jinx. It's coming along nicely. Just but yeah, the house though. The way they they consider your income though is it's like your last two years of income on, on your tax returns, and they average it together. And so what was getting us is they're averaging 2018 and 2019. In 2018, we earned significantly less money than we do now. Um, it was that was kind of the year where income was really stepping up, but it was still pretty low. And so when they averaged it together with 2019, which was a really good year for us, it, it, it resulted in a much lower income. Uh, so now they'll be averaging 2019 and 2020. And though 2020 was rough, it was still way better than 2018. So overall, our, our uh, YouTube income is going to be considered a lot higher. So I'm hoping that'll allow us to get approved for a lot more than we did before. Uh, we'll have to see you guys because the housing market has gotten more expensive. So Then we want to get out of Colorado. We'd like to, but I don't know if we'll be able to or not. That might be a bit optimistic. It's really expensive to move. Yeah, moving. And, and I think the most troublesome part of trying to move to another state is like actually going to look at the houses. Because you got to drive there or yeah. take a plane. or Because uh, you should never, ever buy a house <laughs> off the internet. Yeah, that's just stupid. You, don't even, you shouldn't even get an apartment without looking at it. True. Jinx wanted to do that when we came here to Colorado. Because we were moving from Texas. Was like, was She's fine. like, we don't need to go there. You He's like, see the pictures. We'll just look at the pictures. I was like, Jinx, no. Absolutely <laughs> not. <laughs> I was like, the pictures, are they're only showing you what they want you to see. The best part. Yeah, the best part. And they Photoshop. Them. Yeah, exactly. And so we had one house that was on, the, or, or one uh, apartment that was like on the top of our list when we came here. And it was the first one we looked at. It's one we figured we'd try and move to. And it was such a dump, man, when we actually saw it. Oh, my God. We pulled up into the parking lot, and all the residents were like, don't move here. Mm -hmm. They got bad bugs, and they're shitty. You could tell that they're really unhappy. They're disgruntled residents, so they could have been lying. But one guy, he had, like, a sign Mm -hmm. that he had made and had put it up on his his yard. Don't move here. There's bed bugs and rats. And pretty much, you could tell he was getting kicked out. And that's what they told us, too. They said he was being uh, evicted. He's disgruntled. But still... It didn't matter because we looked at the place and it was it was bad, and that's saying something because we actually moved to a ghetto ass apartment. Yeah, we had like a drug dealer on the corner, mm-hmm. not playing. But it was the best of all the bad places. Yeah, that, it was the best, <laughs> and it was really bad. So it was just yeah, the, the the rental market here is rough, which is why we have a house. And the housing market's rough. It's not as bad as the rental market though. True. We actually pay less money on our mortgage now than we did in rent. Well, yeah, uh, to live in a, a ghetto place, to have drug dealers next door, gunshots. Yep. No water. Grenades and leaky the, roofs. Yep, we had a leaky roof, leaked all of our stuff for years, and yeah, they had a grenade in the damn laundry <laughs> mat. Like they had to have like the bomb patrol come out there and make sure it wasn't like bomb patrol. Bomb yeah. patrol. <laughs> the bomb squad. I don't know what you call them. They just sent in some pups. Yeah, Bomb Patrol <laughs> sounds better. It was a bunch of puppies came in here. Bomb sniffing dogs. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was such a terrible place, guys. Uh, but yeah, we would have ended up in an even worse place if we had bought based on the pictures online. Yeah. But yeah, don't. You can't do that. You got to go. Uh, you got to, like, you know, take a plane or drive up, you know, wherever you're going. You got to look at it, I feel. Especially when it comes to buying a house, which you might be stuck in. Oh, goodness. In. We're just Wow. Let's just pretend that. we didn't see all that. <laughs> I just I feel like you don't really need to weed whack it. It just feels like you just lay out your grass across it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that would be... That might work over there because there's no trees. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Or not as many trees. I mean, I feel like you didn't need to weed whack anything, but... Maybe I just like weed whacking. I, I guess you got to weed whack up along the house, along the edges, yeah. which is where you're supposed to weed whack. Weed whack isn't supposed to be... Weed whackers aren't Everywhere. supposed to be used as, like, a, a oh, lawnmower. Oh, they not let me do it over the, um... The weeds... <laughs> Is it the weeds blocking you? It's the weeds. Oh. Goddamn weeds. I guess that's accurate, though. Because weeds are... They're just a hassle. Good grief. They're always though. causing issues. Yeah, you got a bad, bad weed problem here. That's like our yard. Mm-hmm. If there weren't weeds, there wouldn't be anything. We're proud of our weeds, guys. I am. <laughs> we got every kind of weed you could think of, too. We do. And we literally probably do. Mm-hmm. It's very diverse. We like diversity in our weeds. In our ecosystem. Mm-hmm. It's not just weeds. <laughs> <laughs> I said we like diversity in our weed. There's going to be a lot of people think about other 
Like, well, well are I'm you into indicas or sativas or you a hybrid folk? <laughs> <laughs> Up there in Colorado. We do live in Colorado. True that. Is the turf the same look? Oh, it is. That's the grass. Yeah, it's just grass. It's just grass. Okay. I didn't know if you were going to have turf in some locations and grass in the other. Just look bad. Yeah, yeah it's a, like this is actually, when when you think about calling it turf, it looks kind of shitty. Yeah. Because turf's supposed to be all green and lush. Yep. Yeah, this just looks like grass. Yeah, like a grass that a does. dog been been peeing on. It's got little pee spots mm -hmm. on it. I mean, like, you could, that's what it looks like, little pee spots. It does, doesn't it? I mean, it might not be a dog. Maybe it's a, home, a human pee spot. You know, I know some people that have, like, piss spots at their house. Like, really? Yeah. They Why go outside and outside? piss in that spot because they don't want to walk inside. Like you got a toilet in your house. They don't want to have to go inside. Like, when they're outside, like, people who hang out a lot. Oh, and Outside, and they don't want to have to go inside. I guess I wouldn't know what that's like. So they have a pee spot on there, right outside, and then they, you know, have that little the same little yellow stains that you got all over your yard. I sure do. Uh, the, the yours could have been done by a dog or a cat or something. Or anybody, a homeless mm -hmm. person living in this backyard. Yep. Yeah, this clearly looks like a place where we've had homeless people living for some time, actually. Uh, unfortunately, this is actually going to have to be the end of the first episode. I mean. You got some weeds progress. pulled. Yeah, you got some weeds pulled. You got your, your grass placed a little bit. Yeah, uh, I'll probably place the rest of the grass off camera. Maybe. I mean, if shit. if you got time before, because, yeah, I don't oh, know if you'll have true. time before we yeah, record the next mind. one to get all this done. Uh, we'll have to see uh, what she can get done before then. But what I would really like to see us do is, like, get the, 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 the plants and some decorations going and stuff out here. Mm-hmm. And we'll probably work on the inside like later in the this this shorter series. Yeah, because y'all have seen house flipping. Yeah, y'all have seen the inside. Uh, so we might do that towards the end if we ever if we ever get the this garden done before the end of the series. Because I mean it, it's kind of a big yard. I don't know how much Jinx is planning on doing with it, but it's a big yard. Yeah, this is way bigger than probably our yard. Probably should have bought a smaller one. Yeah. Yep. And there's a lot of trees too, so. Uh, if you don't want all these trees, which I don't know yeah. if you plan on keeping them, you have to do some lumberjacking. Lumberjacking. Like that one, trees should not be that close to the house anyway. Bird mites. Well, yeah, you can get bird mites, but all other kinds of things can crawl. Ants and all kinds of things can crawl out of that tree under your house. You really shouldn't have any trees touching your house, honestly. So I, I think you need to get rid of that. A windstorm comes and blows it down. Yeah, there's that as well. Uh, you're lucky that didn't fall under your house the way you're chopping it. I do what I want. <laughs> so, we're going to go ahead and... an improvement. Uh, yeah, I guess. I mean, how much more damage could be done? Uh, so, yeah, this is going to be the end of today's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video, subscribe to our channel, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment. If you're looking for any links, check out the description of any of our videos. Find links to our PayPal, Patreon, and Teespring store if you'd like to help support the channel. You can also find link to our Discord if you'd like to join our community, and you'll find links to all of our social media, Twitter, Facebook, all that good stuff. You can keep working, Jinx, if you want. Keep on fighting. I'm just being that crazy neighbor. Just staring, staring at people with an axe. With an axe, yeah. <laughs> creeping everybody out. There's somebody new in town. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, if you want, want to watch anything while you wait for the next episode, go check out that front page of our channel. We got like 3,000-something videos. All sorted by genre. Uh, we do play a lot of these simulator games now. Uh, obviously, we have the the two previous house, house flipper series. Uh, you know, we have the farming simulator, um, the car mechanic simulator. I don't even know all of them. We played quite a few of them at this point. Uh, these these survival games, or excuse me, these uh, like simulator games. I like the simulator games. Yeah, it's. Doing real life work in digital world <laughs> <laughs> instead of doing in your real life. Uh, so yeah, we do play a lot of those. Uh, so you should be able to find something to watch while you wait for the next episode, which should be on Saturday. That's the plan. Next episode will come out on this Saturday. Uh, so I do hope to see you on that video, and thanks for watching. <laughs>